Welcome everybody to Next22. Today, we are going to help you understand how to take advantage of the latest product innovations we have done around data integration and BigQuery with our data accelerated content uh, with Cortex Framework. Um, and my name is Chaitanya Paidimukala. I'm head of products for data integration at Google Cloud Data Analytics Group. And I'm joined with my friend and colleague, Alison Hetrick. Uh, she's the director of solutions Cortex Framework at Google Cloud. Today, we're going to touch upon a few things. One is the primary thing is, you know, what is on top of mind for data-driven organizations and enterprises? What are the challenges that these data-driven organizations are facing on a daily basis? What are the key principles that drive you to build a modern data platform? And how can you actually build this with Google Cloud Technologies? Then, you know, you'll be joined with by my friend Allison, who's going to talk about not just building the data platform, but how can you actually use our solution accelerators um, based on Cortex framework for SAP and beyond to get more additional insights. And then you, know, you will also find some you know, valuable links where you can find more information. So with that, let me actually talk about what is on top of mind for you know, data-driven organizations, other enterprises. The biggest challenge you know, one, the customers are facing and all these organizations are facing today is the amount of data that is being thrown at the enterprises. You know, the data growth is exponential. The data is also coming in a lot of different formats. There is unstructured data that is coming into the enterprises, uh, structured data, data in real time, data in batch. The other thing you know, that we also see is almost 75% of the organizations are struggling and they want to operationalize the AI ML, but there are more processing frameworks that are available. It's not just SQL anymore. And you know, sometimes you actually have to process the data in real time. You need streaming analytics. You need latest and greatest AI ML mechanisms to actually process your data uh, and to be able to create effective data products. Uh, we also see that about three-fourths of the data leaders are also asking for real-time access of data. The Looking at the historical data and making decisions is important, but it is also important to preempt looking at the real-time data and just any key business decisions on a daily basis is becoming imperative to these data leaders. So even though we have all these challenges, we have seen that most of the companies are unable to realize any measurable value of the data, being it's purely because obviously data is huge, data requires more than SQL to process, uh, and data is reaching everyone. And this is causing a lot of silos in an organization the customers and organizations require more and more capacity. There is security risk. And this actually is also, you know, has an impact on top and bottom line of the companies, increasing the cost. They are always trying to, you know, plan the capacity. And, you know, it is also affecting the SLAs in the organizations. So we at Google, you know, we think that, you know, there are foundational principles in actually in a modern data platform. Right. When we look at you know, Google, we have 10x thinking. We think about moonshots. What are the next big things that we need to solve that need to be solved? And when we think about the 10x thinking, we want to help empower data-driven organizations and bring that thinking to them. And the way we do it is through bringing data-driven innovation that are actually with a limitless data cloud. So when you actually have a cloud platform that can actually deal with limitless data, and run and process the data at scale with limitless workloads and can actually enable every single user in the organization and beyond the organization to get access to the data and the data, right data reaches the right people in a secure and governed fashion, then it is possible that you can have true limitless innovation. This is something that we want to actually bring to our customers so that they can benefit from the innovation that we have done. So if you look at Google Data Cloud, we actually built this data cloud to solve for every single user, starting from your you know, data producers, data engineers, ML uh, engineers, data scientists, and the data consumers and people who are actually, and data product managers. And you know, we have mechanisms to bring in the data, collect the data, store the data in a purpose-built fashion, analyze the data on our BigQuery platform, and then not just analysis of the data, but to be able to find new insights that you can actually help activate these insights in your downstream application so that you are making better business decisions. 
And all of this data cloud platform is built on our Google Cloud infrastructure with the latest and greatest security mechanisms, encryption mechanisms. We actually make a lot of the things that were in the thoughts of our customers before, like high availability and you know disaster recovery, we make it an afterthought with our platform. And we not only have this data cloud on Google Cloud that works on, with Google Cloud infrastructure, but we also have enabled so that our partners can work with the data cloud. We actually sponsor a lot of these open source technologies. And we also allow the capabilities to actually cut across to other third-party clouds because we know that you know, customers want to leverage some of these capabilities on other clouds. Um, and the way we do it is because we have purpose-built services for each, each one of the uh, use cases that we want to solve. Like for enterprise data integration, we have data fusion, or if you want to do serverless Spark loads, uh, you know, Spark workloads to process data, we have services for those. So we have a lot of different services for you know, all the personas, but because they are built on the same fabric and they're using the same governance and data fabric, we make it easy so that the services work seamlessly with each other. And this is only how you know, we are able to make this happen because BigQuery is at our heart of innovation, because BigQuery grew out of our own necessity to innovate, to build a better storage uh, mechanism, and we use it uses Colossus as, as a storage mechanism. We have a unique way of ensuring that there is always computing capacity, and we use our internal computing infrastructure and cluster management system called Borg. We also have Dremel, which is our query mechanism. Uh, that is built on BigQuery, and that is how we are doing it. And we also have Cloud Data Fusion that actually helps you bring in all these enterprise data from SAP and beyond other applications in a comprehensive no-code fashion so that you know you can lower the total cost of ownership. With that, let me hand over to my uh, friend and colleague, Allison, who's going to talk about, you know, I've talked about the technology stack, but it only solves one piece of the puzzle, but how with Cortex framework, you can actually take full advantage of the technology stack and built on top of it to actually solve real world problems. Over to you, Alison. Thank you so much, Chai. Let's now take a look at some of the solution accelerators and content for enterprise data and beyond, and some of the work that we're doing in this space to help you accelerate your journey to the data cloud. Insights across the operation today have never been more complex. There's a variety of different data sets that you contend with as you look at the notion of being able to connect and provide insights in support of your business or your business operations. So the question for many is, how can we help you get connected insights faster? One of the ways we're doing this is by introducing Cortex Framework. There are three main areas of Cortex framework that are focused around accelerating your journey in data analytics and to the data cloud. The first focuses on providing connectors that are endorsed, Google connectors, partner connectors, and those that we've been able to validate and vet that work very well with our templates and content. The second area focuses around the ability for you to accelerate your journey to the data cloud and providing templates and content and examples to help get you started and to make that journey go a whole lot more cost effective and faster. The last area of value and focus is around how to tie all of the templates and content together to develop innovative use cases and solutions and to have those solutions be delivered not only through Google, but with those of our partners as well. So what's inside Cortex framework? What are some of the key elements? The first area focuses around the connectivity and the connectors, the ability to manage and integrate your data pipelines across a variety of different data sources and to do so in an endorsed way. The second focuses around providing reference architectures blueprints that not only help you to understand how to apply our data cloud platform tools and technologies, but giving you that strategy, that approach based on best practices, the recipe on how you can accelerate and deliver on solutions utilizing Google platform technologies and tools. The third area focuses on how to help you deploy and take advantage of delivering analytics, utilizing Google BigQuery and our major platform 
capabilities with BigQuery. And last but not least, tying that together with sample machine learning models, examples, and content with our AI and ML templates. As we look at Cortex framework, starting with connectivity with Cloud Data Fusion, there's the ability to take advantage of accessing a variety of different connectors to a number of different data sets and data sources, whether those data sets be from Google, third party, IoT and streaming, or even enterprise applications such as SAP and other enterprise data sources. Cloud Data Fusion provides a variety of connectors and content that can help you to connect and access and provide data into Google BigQuery and provide you with a comprehensive approach to do so. As we then take a look at what's in Cortex Foundation, at the very center is a set of pre-delivered models and content that not only help you process the data coming in from the raw, but also applying some of the specific change data capture processing, units of measure processing, as well as additional types of enrichment that may be required to have true, accurate, and consistent data coming from enterprise data sets and data sources, particularly with environments such as SAP. To the right of the data foundation, we are also providing best practices-based examples with AI and ML templates and content for more common use cases around a variety of line of business and industry focus areas. To the left of the data foundation, we're providing you with the ability to have application layer templates that can allow you to readily and easily share data as microservices and expose your data out through a PubSub or other applications that are interested in accessing the data. So whether that data is developed with our data foundation content or models or even yours, Cortex is providing a complete foundation of content to help you accelerate in this journey. But we're not only providing access from a data perspective and some of these examples, we're also remembering the end user and providing ready to run content with our looker blocks and templates for common types of operational analytics use cases and scenarios. Let's take a closer look at some of the templates and content that we're making available. First and foremost, we have focused on SAP as one of our initial scope and focus areas for our data models. It's not the only scope and focus for us, but it's an important one because for many enterprises, integrating data to and from SAP environments and delivering on comprehensive data models that can help support your analytics journey is top of mind and is incredibly important to get right. We're taking the guesswork out of the integration and the content and the templates we're providing. What we're also doing is we're providing flexibility with the templates we're delivering as part of Cortex framework to allow you to take your content readily and easily, share it with external applications and to make that easily available to other systems. So depending on where your journey takes you with your data analytics and the specific insights that you're looking to connect, Cortex can help you accelerate and get there faster. Let's now take a closer look at some of the examples that we can provide in support of our data foundation. Specifically for SAP, whether it is analytics focusing on finance or sales and distribution, to readily and easily provide you with the data models, the looker blocks and templates to get you started. Answering questions such as day sales outstanding in finance, for example, where are there overdue receivables, or in sales and distribution, is that order on time or in full? All of those types of operational analytics questions can readily and easily be answered with our content that we're making available to you today. In addition to operational and analytics scenarios, we're also focusing around key use cases. Demand sensing is a great example of this. The ability to tie in retail sales data along with weather data, revenue, and sales and order data can allow you to rapidly and easily understand if there are signals that may influence your latest demand forecast for a product. All of this information helps you to start to connect insights and to start to apply 
the data signals into your business processes. Cortex framework providing these examples can help you get started. And so while we're delivering a lot of content around enterprise data sets and data sources such as SAP, Cortex can also readily and easily give you standard content and data models for weather, holiday and calendar data, and other types of data sets and data signals. So it's a great way to get started and to fast track your data and analytics journey. As we think about the value and the key capabilities with Cortex, you can focus on reducing your cost, time, and risk with your overall deployment by taking advantage of not only our connectors with Data Fusion, our BigQuery Data Cloud and Data Platform capabilities, but also reducing the overall planning and design efforts around those implementations. Cortex is able to give you those blueprints to help you get started. We're also providing real deployment content and templates that you can extend, expand, and make your own. And take full advantage of these templates, even with your custom developed content that you are developing in Google BigQuery. And last but not least, Cortex provides that foundation and framework that not only helps Google deliver solutions into market faster for our customers, but for you, the ability to deliver solutions to your business a whole lot faster and more efficiently and effectively. And having our partners as well as solutions being developed through Cortex Framework provides you with a standardized approach to get insights faster and to be able to connect data more easily. With that, that concludes today's session. Where do you go and learn more at this point? We're providing a lot of valuable information for you to get started. Number one, we have public facing information and templates and content that are open source and available for you to readily access, download, and to start to take advantage of and get started today. We also have public information on our website. And most importantly, we're interested in learning more from you about what's top of mind for you. So feel free to reach out to us at cortexframework at google.com. That concludes today's session. Chai and I want to thank you for your time. We look forward to working with you and to engaging with you further on your data cloud journey and helping you understand how our latest innovations and lean frameworks such as Cortex Framework can help you deliver value to your business and get there faster. Thank you again for your time.